I've got three areas on the farm that I want to plant fruit trees and or bushes. This is where the orchard's going, about 15 trees higher off the valley, off the frost line. Today we need to get ready. There are three major things we've got to do. Right there, an elderberry patch. It will help hold up that bank. It'll give us the wonderful medicine that elderberries can provide. We don't let the cows in that creek anyway. So that's kind of a unused space. And across from the elderberry patch, the blueberry patch. Chickens have been preparing this area. Shoot, we're gonna have to get these chickens out. That's not that hard. <laughs> to make our life a lot easier, we wanna get the auger the, for the tractor. The auger is like this spinny thing that you put on the back that drills holes in the ground. It's for fence posts, but it's also great for planting trees. That will help us a lot since we're gonna be planting like 50-ish trees slash bushes. Let's see if the tractor starts, Jonah. We don't have a bad battery, we have a short somewhere, an electrical short. All right, we have it charging up a little bit. Hopefully that'll be enough. It seemed like it almost wanted to start. All right, let's brown, let's see if it'll start now. Let's go. Yeah. Why don't we just take the truck and go lift the auger into it? Well, no, that auger weighs probably 400, 500 pounds. And uh, Don is gonna need this truck to go get the rest of the fruit trees. We've eaten lunch. We're gonna see if this tractor is gonna start. I've been dreading this all day, like, hooking up this auger. I know it isn't easy, but I'm hoping it's worth it. Instead of hand digging 15 holes. there safe and sound feeling really nervous right now anxious I just gotta calm down too blessed to be stressed, too blessed to be stressed. I do have only an hour and a half I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to maneuver this to the wall and I can't do this by myself but my dad's coming I think I think I could get the tractor back right here. Lift that up. I wonder if there's a way to wedge this up. How about that? This on the other side. No matter of pushing that in. Oh my gosh. Oh, shoot. This arm has reached out. And I guess it's gotten rusty. It needs some grease. This is probably an old way to grease it somewhere on here. This has got to go in for us to be able to get on there. It's got to be able to adjust. This hooks up to the PTO. This is the thing on the tractor that spins this. This would spin, making the auger spin and be able to dig. Right, now we're going to get this in. All right, now try it. Hey, Pop. Uh, you need some help to get that thing on there, I think. I know. Well, I might be at a roadblock anyway, because you know this retracting arm? <coughs> it's stuck. And it's wide open. It's wide out. It's far out. Oh. You know how that's supposed, to, yeah. that's supposed to retract in, and you're it's supposed to be able to pull it off, pull it in to adjust it? We yeah. can probably hit it with a hammer. You know, put a board on it. Hit it. Yeah. Oil it a little bit. You're strong as an ox. You know that, don't you? Hey. We're all stronger than an ox. Actually, that's good. I would give up. You never give up. No, I gave it up. <laughs> You're worse than me not to give up. That's a sure an understatement good. of the year. <laughs> I've never seen anybody. <laughs> more, I I was out more, uh, tenacious than I am, except for you came off. We got it. I am in 
show right now that we got that. That we got that. The second thing that needs to be done is getting mulch. We've got to get mulch lined up. I want to go right there with this load of mulch. That means we need to go through this pasture, which means hopefully he can get through here. Question is, can he get through this gate? Good, he's got in. See if we load, if we set it down right here, and this is where all our fruit trees are planted, we just walk down the hill. There it is. No problem. And third, we gotta get our specialist here, Danu, who's helping orchestrate, implement this, install this. He's coming today. We'll get him set up squared away make sure we're all good and ready to go for tomorrow the big planting day so i had our pat i had our patch cleared by our chickens and you should have easy easy digging right here we won't need the auger here so like three rows of cane fruits blackberries raspberries and black raspberries mm. and they would just need a trellis so we could do them on contour it would look nice yeah that would be great and then the blueberries transplanting those blueberries down into here not all of them just enough to divide that patch to make room for the gummy berries okay. to be interplanted and then leaving room for the gummy berries to come in and be interplanted here I just saw something crazy when I was talking to Danu you guys won't believe this look oh my gosh it happened <laughs> we got female goose we're supposed to get 12 to 16 of these a year a goose egg a goose egg <laughs> it's huge although not quite as big as I thought I gotta show the kids Waddle where are you at Waddle Waddle <laughs> not only do you guard this flock you lay you lay in eggs watch this hey look I gotta show you something Whoa! <laughs> it's a huge egg. why do you think that egg's so big where, where'd it come from the Icelandics Chicken must have a big egg. You think? Let's go crack it. Wait, 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 wait. What do you think it is? A triple? A fake. Can I? No, is, you think it's a fake? It's not a fake. Don't break it. Don't break it, please. Okay, let's go see if mom knows. Okay. Come on, let's you go show mom. You know what it is, don't you? Okay, you go show mom. Yeah. You, know, you know what it is? I do. Here. No, don't you dare drop that, though. I won't. Please don't drop it. I can't even put Do not drop it. her. They don't know. Not even Jonah. Okay. Let's see if uh, your mother knows. Hold on. Let me come in there with you. A goose egg! Oh. <laughs> that's right, that's right. That's right, okay. Just show mom that huge egg. Whoa. Look at that big egg. Is that a goose egg? Yes, you guessed it right away. That's a goose egg. Oh my egg. gosh, where did you get it? In which she laid it on the ground where the, where the uh, chickshaw was last night. That is crazy. She's a she. I know it's She's for a breakfast. She. Yep. <laughs> That's crazy. We goose eggs we, are good for baking, I feel like. But I don't know. We have to look at We up. gotta fry it and just taste it. See okay. what a goose egg tastes like. Okay. A taste Let's test. Taste test. This is crazy. Is that is that blood? <laughs> well it was quite the struggle, I'm sure. <laughs> you see the size of that thing? Yay! We're gonna get like twelve of these this year. That's it. That's twelve yep. your egg. Those sell for like sixteen bucks. It's a goose egg. Oh. It's uh, a rum and tuft of goose egg. I don't hear a goose in there. You don't hear the goose in there? Uh -huh. About to bring the cows in, about to wrap up this vlog. Look at this. He's planted these on a nice little contour here. <laughs> That's gonna look that looks really neat. Do you guys see that? That's gonna look really cool. He's got a row here, a row there, a row there. I couldn't be more pleased. When needed, we can run our Chickshaw, our Chickshaw Mini Me, right through here. Once these get older, the fruit has produced, it's fallen on the ground, we'll run the chickens through. It's gonna be super nice. Tomorrow, tomorrow, planting the orchard, planting the apple trees. Got the auger here with the tractor. That's gonna make your life easier. Let's do that tomorrow. It's just on here? Lots and lots. Rebecca, have you seen this? Just on it. Is this cut up too, Anna? Okay, I'll go to the That is not sliced. Or it is cut into chunks. Yes. And ready to be frozen. Oh, like 
Thank you. It's not a pillow, Rebecca. It's not a mattress. Like where it's like, it's that Instagram. I know. We're like goobers. It's not a bean bag, Rebecca. So amazing. Control yourself. And what is going on here? So this is little bits. We're gonna do little bags and freeze them so that when we want to cook some collards or some eggs with just a little mm. of that good flavor, flavor in there, it's easy. Yay.